In this video, we will be using the number bond strategy to recognize the relationships between numbers. A number bond is a picture of the relationship between a number and the parts combined to build that number. This strategy will be applied to the following subtraction problem. Ava has eight pieces of candy. Three pieces are starbursts. The rest of the pieces are M&Ms. How many pieces of candy are M&Ms? The number sentence that matches this word problem is 8 minus 3. In this video, we will demonstrate how students can use the number bond strategy to solve this number sentence using concrete, pictorial, and abstract models. We will begin with concrete models. I am currently using the Math Learning Center online app, which is a great tool that anyone can use to access math resources, such as the 10 frame pictured here. The word problem states that Ava has eight pieces of candy in all. This means that our whole is eight. Of the eight pieces of candy that Ava has, three are starbursts. We are going to use blue counters to represent the three starbursts in our 10 frame. One, two, three. Currently, this 10 frame represents only one part of our whole. To find the other part, which is the amount of M&Ms Ava has, we must count up from 3 until we reach our whole of 8. Red counters will be used to represent the amount of M&Ms. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, you can see, we have reached our whole of 8 by combining the two parts. There are 5 red counters, which means that Ava has 5 pieces of M&Ms. If you know that the whole and one of the parts, you can take away or subtract the known part from the whole to find the missing part. In this concrete representation, however, we built one part and counted up to find the missing part. Now we will use pictorial models to demonstrate the number bond strategy. We know that our whole is 8, so we will write the numeral 8 to represent 8 pieces of candy. We will then circle our whole as we begin constructing the number bond. Next, we will use squares to represent one part of our whole. Our known part is three starbursts. One, two, and three. The line that I am drawing represents the relationship between a whole and its parts. The three starbursts are part of the eight total pieces of candy. This number bond allows us to visualize the missing part of our whole, as it is represented with a question mark. As you can see, we are solving to determine the missing part of our whole. This missing part is the amount of M&Ms that Ava has. The final section of this video will demonstrate the number bond strategy using abstract models. First, I will create a number bond right next to the current pictorial model and write the number 8 as our whole. In one part of the whole, I will write the number 3 to represent the three starbursts that Ava has. In the other part of the whole, I will represent the number of M&Ms Ava has with a question mark. The number of M&Ms will be the solution to the subtraction word problem. Both number bonds clearly reflect the subtraction number sentence. To solve the problem, we can count up from 3 until we reach 8, our whole. After counting up, we know that the missing part to our whole is 5, meaning that Ava has 5 pieces of M&Ms. 5 M&Ms is the solution to our word problem. In this video, we demonstrated the use of number bonds with a subtraction word problem. With number bonds, students recognize the relationships between numbers through a written model. This model shows how the numbers are related and helps students to clearly visualize the part-part-whole relationship. It is also important to note that number bonds allow the students to see the inverse relationship between addition and subtraction. Students are also able to see the related facts from the number bond. For more student math strategy videos, please check out our UH Math Education channel. Thank you for watching.